Recording in progress. Here we go. The first book for us today is called Ladybugs. We'll talk about ladybugs. Have you ever seen a ladybug? Yes. Yeah, you've seen them. They're kind of pretty, oh. right? They're red with black spots. They're beautiful. Ladybugs are beautiful. That's the name of the book. Ladybug. 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 Five of them. That's right. I'll read first. Shh. Listen, and then I'll ask you to repeat. Okay. I'll read first. Look in the shh, look in the garden. A little round bug is sitting on a flower. It is a ladybug. This is a flower and this is a ladybug. A little, uh, uh, a little round bug. Is look in the garden. Your turn. Ready, go. Go. All right, very good. Look in the garden. A little round bug is sitting on a flower. It is a ladybug. Do you like ladybugs? I hope you do. Let's see what's going to happen next. Ladybugs can be red or yellow or orange. Have you seen red or yellow or orange ladybugs? Usually they're red. Sometimes you can see yellow and orange ones too. Most ladybugs have black spots. I'll read one more time. Ladybugs can be red or yellow or orange. Most ladybugs have black spots. When I do that, this thing appears at the bottom. Can I remove it? I'm not sure if I can. Oh, yes, I can move it a little bit to the side where it would not bother anybody like that. And now it's your turn to read. Let's read together. Ready, go. Yes, they have nice spots. Very good. Good job reading, everyone. A ladybox. Next page. Look at this. A uh, ladybug's bright colors and spots keep it safe. Animals know ladybugs do not taste good. They don't taste good. They taste yucky, not like pizza or ice cream. Ladybugs don't taste very well. That's why other animals do not eat them. Your turn. Ready, go. That's right, a ladybug's bright colors and spots keep it safe. Animals know ladybugs do not taste good. Look at this picture. There's a leg. How many legs does a ladybug have? We have to count, right? Uh, I can see one, two, three on this side. So there must be three legs on the other side too. Three plus three equals five. Three plus three. Six, that's right. You're very smart. And here's a wing. Ladybugs have wings too. I'll read. Ladybugs have six legs for walking. Yes, they walk on their six legs. They also have wings for flying from place to place. They fly to one place to another place, from one flower to another flower. They have legs and they have wings. Ready? Go. Aditya, are you reading? Your mouth is not moving. How can you read if your mouth is not moving? Please read, okay? When everybody reads, you have to read together. I'll read one more time. Ladybugs have six legs for walking. 
They also have wings for flying from place to place. Yes. Do you have wings for flying? I have. No. My... No. Oh, no. No. If you were an angel, you would have wings, but you're not angels, so you don't have wings. Let's go to the next page. Oh, what's that? Jelly beans? What are they? I wonder what they are. Eggs? Oh, ladybug bread. eggs. Ladybug eggs. Maybe they are sausages. Or what do they look like? Chicken eggs? <laughs> ladybug eggs. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Ladybug <laughs> eggs. I'll read. A ladybug lays its eggs on the back of a leaf, not on the top of the leaf, not on the front of the leaf, but on the back of the leaf. Why on the back? Baby ladybugs will come from the eggs. Why on the back? To protect them from other animals so other animals cannot see them and eat them, right? That's why they're hidden under the back of a leaf. Let's read these four lines. If you're not reading, I'm watching you. If you're not reading, I'm going to ask you to read alone. Ready, go. Good job, good job reading. Somebody's making noise. Who's making noise? Mahima, is it you? A ladybug lays its eggs on the back of a leaf. Baby ladybugs will come from the eggs. What will ladybugs, what will baby ladybugs look like? Do you know? Let's see. There they are. Yuck. They don't look very beautiful, do they? When they're little, when they are babies, they're not beautiful. They're kind of black and yellow. I'll read. Listen. Baby ladybugs are black with light spots. Those are yellow spots, light spots. A baby will eat lots of tiny bugs to help it grow. What do they eat? Do they eat leaf? No, they don't eat the leaf. They eat little bugs. Little bugs over there. That's what they eat. Those tiny little tiny bugs. They like them. That's what baby ladybugs eat. Let's read. Ready, go. Baby Baby ladybugs are black with light spots. A baby will eat lots of tiny bugs to help it grow. What will they look like? Let's see. When they grow. Ooh, look at that. Still doesn't look like a ladybug. It's still a baby. A little, a big baby now. The baby keeps eating and growing. They eat and grow like you. You eat and you grow. If you don't eat, you stay little. So you have to eat a lot. Then it starts to change. It's slowly changing. The baby will look like a ladybug soon. Let's read these five lines. Ready, go. Good job. Oneli, are you reading? Oneli, your chair is moving and your eyes are closed, but your mouth is moving. I'm not sure about that. Okay. You're reading like this, Oneli. That's not a very nice way to read. You cannot see the book then, right? I'll read one more time. Listen, the baby keeps eating and growing. Then it starts to change. The baby will look like a ladybug. Uh, I'll read the next page. Look at that. People like ladybugs because ladybugs help in gardens. 
Do, 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 do. Please don't make noise, okay? Or I have to mute everybody. People like lady. I'll read one more time. People like ladybugs because ladybugs help in gardens. Ladybugs like to eat bugs that hurt plants. Some bugs, they eat beautiful flowers. They hurt plants. But ladybugs, they eat those bad bugs. So ladybugs are good. That's why people like them, because ladybugs eat bad bugs. Bad bugs who destroy plants. That's why ladybugs are good. The more ladybugs you have, the happier you will be. Let's read. Ready, go. Yes, people like ladybugs because ladybugs help in gardens. Ladybugs like to eat bugs that hurt plants. Wow, look how many ladybugs there are in this picture. There are hundreds of them. And here's one. And there are hundreds. And here's one. I'll read. When winter comes, when it's cold, what do ladybugs do? Ladybugs hide under rocks and logs. They hide for the winter. They sleep in the winter like bears. In spring, they will come out to move around again. When spring comes, they come out and they move around plants and flowers. They sleep in the winter on the rocks and logs. Let's read. Ready, go. That's right. When winter comes, ladybugs hide under rocks and logs. In spring, they will come out to move around again. The end of the first story, ladybugs. It's a beautiful story about ladybugs. The second story for us today, before we go and read about Biff and Chip and Keeper's Magic Adventure, first we have to read one more story. It's about Molly, Molly's new team. It's about sports. Do you like sports? I'm sure you like sports. Everybody likes sports. You like PE with Prasad, sir, right? And you like sports. Let's look at it. Molly's new team is the name of the story. Molly is the name of the girl. New team. Let's read. Molly's new team. Molly's new team. That's right. Molly's new team. Let's see what's going to happen to Molly. Look at that. Where is Molly? There is Molly. Here is Molly. That's her name. Her name is not Aditya. Her name is not Satini. Her name is not Natanya. Her name is not Sanidi. Her name is not Mishael. Her, not, her name is not Gayali or Bihansa or Sarah. What's her name? Her name is Molly, right? I'll read. What are they doing? They're playing with a ball and a bat. I'll read the first page. Molly loved to play ball. She loved to catch and throw and hit and run and slide. She loved many things that have to do with baseball. Let's read together. Ready, go. Molly. That's right. Only in this page, uh, page two, right? Only the second page. Huh? Yes, she liked many things. What else did Molly like? Let me move this thing away on top over there. Okay, Molly played ball with her friends. Who are friends? These are friends. How many friends? Four friends. Molly played ball with her friends. She knew everyone on the field and she liked that. Let's read. Ready, go. Molly played ball. Molly 
Yes, Molly played oh, Molly played ball with her friends. She knew everyone on the field and she liked that. Of course, you would like that too, wouldn't you? If you played with your friends on the field. But it says here, Molly wanted to play more. She wanted to play more. She wanted to learn more. So she joined a team. She joined the team. Yes, there is the team on the field. She joined the real team. Let's read. Ready, go. But Molly. But Yes, join the team. Very good. Dimet, are you reading? Very good. Pay attention. Dimet. Okay. Uh, page five. Molly was scared on her first day. Why was she scared? What was she scared of? Monsters? Ghosts? Why was she scared? Let's, let's find out. She did not know anyone on the team. No friends. That's why she was scared. Because there are no friends there on the field. And no one knew her. That's why she was scared. Let's read together. Ready, go. That's right. Very good. Kemiru, are you reading? Kemiru. No? Why are you not reading? Please read. Reading is important for you. Then you can learn English fast. Yes, she was scared. Let's see what's gonna find what was what's gonna happen to her next. There's a picture. Can you see it? Yes, they're talking. Where's Molly? Molly's alone over there. Why is she alone? Because she doesn't have any friends. Molly took a deep breath. How do you take a deep breath? <sighs> like this. She took a deep breath and walked onto the field. No one seemed to notice. Nobody knew her. Nobody paid attention. Nobody went to talk to her or say hi. Of course, she's kind of disappointed a little bit or sad a little bit or scared a little bit. Let's read. Ready, go. Molly took a deep breath and no one seemed to notice. Yes, Molly was sad. You would be sad too. She thought about going home. Shall I go home? Shall I go and play with my friends? Nobody knows me here. Nobody can see me here. Then she saw a bat at the ball. Where? Here's a bat. Here's a ball. Hmm. Look, she's looking at it. What is she going to do? Eat them? I don't think so. Maybe she's going to show how good she is at it. Let's read these five lines. Ready, go. She saw a bat in the ball. What is she going to do? Let's see. Uh -huh. Molly knew just what to do. She knew just what to do. How did she know? Because she's really good at playing this, uh, this ball game. She knew just what to do. She picked up the bat. Then she threw the ball high in the air. She picked up the bat. She threw the ball up and boom, she hit it. But we'll read that part 
on the next page. Let's read page eight together. Ready, go. That's right. Let Nuda, are you reading? Yes, I didn't see your mouth opening, so maybe you're not reading. Molly knew just what to do. She threw the ball high in the air and she hit it with a bat. Boom. Where's the ball? It's high in the air. It's flying up higher and higher and higher and higher. It flies over the field, over the fence. It flies to Mituni's house. Uh-oh. Through the window. Ouch. Wow, yelled a girl with dark brown hair. Did everybody see that? This girl can hit. Wow, she's a very special girl. Molly is a very special girl. She can, she can hit a ball with a bat really hard. So it goes to Mituni's house. That's how hard she can hit it. Wow, she's amazing. She's a super girl. Let's read. Ready, go. And, and she can Yes. Wow, yelled the girl with dark brown hair. Did everybody see that? This girl can hit. This girl is special. Molly smiled and said, My name is Molly. I'm Lucy, said the girl, and I'm glad you're here, Molly. She's glad she's happy because now they can be friends. Two girls became friends. Lucy and Molly will be best friends soon and they will play ball together. Let's read. Ready? The last page. Read loudly. Ready? Go. Molly, Molly is that's right. What is your best friend's name? You can tell me. Do you have best friends? What's your best friend's name? You can tell me if you have a best friend. Wait a second. What's your best friend? You can unmute yourself so you can tell me. Let Nura, who's your best friend? My best Okay, you can raise your hands, then I'll ask you if everybody speaks at the same time. I can't hear anything. Too noisy. My ears, I have to change them. I need better ears. Maybe elephant's ears would be better than mine. My ears are going to break because I'm using the earphones, see? And all the screaming comes here. <laughs> uh, Binuri's hand is up. I'll ask Binuri first. Tell us, Binuri, who's your best friend? My, my best friend is Mituni. All right. Thank you. Gayali, who's your best friend? I unmuted you. Just tell us. Let me. Oh, I see. Great. Thank you. Saviru, who's your best friend? Ovindu. Ovindu. Got it. Thank you. Oneli, who's your best friend? My best friend is Evin. Evin. Got it. Perfect. Thank you. Mahit, who's your best friend? Who is your best friend in your class? Senu, uh, Aditya. Aditya is your best friend. Great. She's a good, she must be a good, a good friend, right? Um, Limansa, who's your best friend? Kemiru. Okay, Kemiru is your best friend. Got it. Uh, Sanidi, who's your best friend? 
Sunny D, who's your best friend? I'm with you. Hmm? One more time. With me. Okay, great. Thank you. With me. Behansa, who's your best friend? Hmm? Behansa, who's your best friend? Abhishek. Abhishek, got it. Mituni, who's your best friend? Pinoli. Okay. Uh, Mahima, who's your best friend? Abhishek. Abhishek. Oh, many people like Abhishek. Let Nura, who's your best friend? Sharif. Okay, great. Who's my best friend? Do you know who my best friend is? <laughs> my best friend is, let's see, who's going to be my best friend? My best friend. Satini wants to be my best friend? Okay, Satini, high five. Great. Limansa too? Okay, Limansa, high five. Let's be best friends. Anyone else wants to be my best friend? Mahit too? And Abhishek? Okay, high five. Yeah. Michelle too? Okay. Who else wants to be my best friend? Okay, everybody who wants to be my best friend, give me a high five. All right. But don't break your cameras, okay? Then you cannot study after that. Be careful with your cameras. Don't break your computers. Now it's time for, you know what, right? It's time for the magic adventure. Are you ready? I hope you're ready. Let's see, let's see. Where is it? Where is the magic adventure? It's called In the Garden, okay? In the Garden, the magic adventure. Let's see, can you see it? Yes? Can you see the picture? Can you see it? Nod your head if you can see it like this. Can you see it? Yes. If you cannot see, well, shake your head like this if you cannot see it. I'll ask you. Can you see it? Yes. 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 Okay. You can all see it. Great. Perfect. As long as you can see it, let's move on to the next page. Keeper. Keeper is their younger brother, right? That's him over there. Keeper went into Chip's room and picked up the magic key. The key began to glow. Oh, help, said Keeper. He's all alone. Will he go on a magic adventure all alone? Where are his brother and sister? Oh, there they are. His brother and sister are playing on the playground. Keeper ran outside and looked for Biff and Chip. Help, he called. The key is glowing. Biff and Chip were playing with Wilf and Wilma. This is Wilf. This is Wilma. They're playing together on the playground in the sand pit. They're playing with the sand, with a little car and a little pipe. And there's a can of soda over there. And there's a cat and there's a sand castle. That's a nice sand castle, isn't it? Look at the magic key, cold keeper. It's time for the magic adventure. Biff was angry. She was cross with keeper. Hmm. We wanted to play. Why did you come here, Keeper? Come on, everyone, she yelled. Run inside. Get to the magic house. Because when the magic works, they become small, and they, then they need to go through the magic house, through the door, to have the magic adventure. But the magic house is too far away. What's going to happen? It was too late. The magic began to work, and the children got smaller and smaller and smaller, and they're tiny, as, as small as ants. See those ants over there? That's the children, that's not ants. The children were in the grass and everything looked big. The grass was like a jungle. Oh no, what big flowers, said Keeper. Chip saw bumblebee. He didn't like it. And he didn't like the jungle. He's scared. Look at him. Uh-oh. This big bumblebee, it's, it's going to sting you and it's going to hurt a lot because it's huge, as big as a horse. Let's get out of here, he said. Let's get out of grass. Where are they going? The children came out of the jungle, out of the grass jungle. They came to a mountain. What is the mountain? That's the sand pit. What a big mountain, said Wilf. 
Keeper is holding a flower. He took a flower with him. And the bee is flying away over there. Chip began to climb. He wanted to get to the top. Let's go, everyone. Come on, he said. Let's climb up to the top. There are little bugs. See those little bugs? There's an ant. They're not little. They're kind of big now. Wow. The children got to the top. Keeper was hot. <sighs> it's so hot. I don't like climbing mountains, he said. The children looked at the sand. It looks like a desert, said Biff. Wow. Let's go down. Oh, no, said Keeper. I'm hot. Give me some water to drink. I want water. And there's the sand castle in the distance. Looks exactly like a desert. Look at the toy car, said Wilma. Let's get inside and ride down. Yeah, let's not walk, let's ride. Riding is easier. We can ride down to the desert. They all got inside and whoosh, the car took them down the mountain. This is fun, said Wilma. Keeper doesn't think it's fun. Keeper's eyes are closed. Ah, help. He probably shouts. It's too fast. The little bugs are running away, afraid of the car. Uh-oh, there's a cat. Meow says the cat. The car stopped in the sand. The children climbed out. Oh no, said Wilf. Look at that big cat. Meow. The cat looks hungry. Is he going to eat the children? The children ran away from the cat. They climbed inside a bottle. Keeper was frightened. Oh, help. Somebody help me. Keeper, this one's, this one's Keeper, the small one. I don't like this, he said. He's scared. Everybody's scared. They are afraid of the cat. The cat looks as big as an elephant, maybe bigger than an elephant for these little children. Meow. The cat looked inside the bottle. It pushed it with its paw. Meow. Go away, cat, shouted Keeper. Shoo, everyone yelled. Shoo, shoo, go away. Floppy came. Bow, wow. Floppy chased the cat away. The children climbed out of the bottle. Good old Floppy. Thank you, Floppy, for chasing the cat away. Now the cat cannot eat them. They walked over the desert. Everyone felt hot. Everyone felt very, very hot. I want a drink. I'm thirsty, said Keeper. Water. Give me water. Look, said Wilf. Giant strawberries. The children ran to eat them. The strawberries are huge. Wow. I love strawberries, said Chip. So do I, said Will. Let's eat. They're so big. The children ate the strawberries. They pulled off big lumps. Keeper licked his lips. I like this adventure now, he said. They're covered with strawberries. His clothes are red. Those are strawberry spots. It began to rain. Uh-oh, what big drops, said Wilma. I feel sick now, said Keeper. So do I. Why are they sick? They ate too much of strawberries. They ate too much. Now they're very full. And look at that big drop. It fell on Keeper's head. Splash. They're huge. The children ran to a giant flower pot. This is a flower pot. It was upside down. They hid under it. The key began to glow. The key is glowing. The magic was over. I can't see. Where is everything? Why is it so dark here? Said Chip. Somebody turned the lights on. But the light is on. They're outside. He had the flower pot on his head. He couldn't see. That, that's why it was dark for him. I like your hat, said Wilma. Beautiful hat. <laughs> it's not a hat. It's a flower pot. Children went back to play. Dad looked at his strawberries. Hmm, I don't know, he said. There must be giant slugs around here. Some slugs are eating my strawberries. Hmm, I should put some slug medicine, slug repellent, so they don't eat my strawberries. Who ate strawberries? 
Did slugs eat them? I don't think so. Aditya ate them. <laughs> or who ate those strawberries? It's a mystery. We will never know. Something happened to strawberries. Would you like to have some strawberries? I'm sure you would. What would you like to have? A big strawberry or a big apple or a big piece of pizza or a big toffee? Huge, like this big. What would you like to have? You can tell me. I'm going to allow you to unmute yourself so you can tell me. What do you want? A giant piece of pizza? Strawberry. Pizza. Pizza. Pizza would be nice too. Strawberry. Strawberry. Stop saying sir. Just give me the answer. Orange. Wait a second. Yes, I'm going to. If you want to say something, Kimiro, wait a second. Here, Kimiro, tell us what. I want orange. You want an orange? How big? As big as an apple? As big as a watermelon? As big as no, a, it's small. As big as your house? Yes. Yes, an orange as big as your house. That's nice. That's gonna be a very big orange. If you would like to uh, tell us something, raise your hand, click on the button, and tell us. Okay. Uh, let's see. Well, let me. Let me. Who? Mahit. Mahit. Tell me. So I. Mm -hmm. I'll unmute you. Wait, one more time, Mahit. I like to eat giant uh, pizza as big as my house. As big as your house. Okay, beautiful. Limansa. I want to apple big as my house. Apple as big as your house. Okay, great. Uh, Bihansa. Uh, Bihansa? I want a pizza bigger than my house. A pizza as big as your house. Great. Uh, I think somebody's calling you. Dun, 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 dun. I can hear. Kemiru, yes. I want... I want pizza. Pizza, as big as your house. Got it. I thought you wanted an orange. Now you want a pizza. You cannot have two. You can have half a pizza and half an orange. Uh, Gayali. I want a tapia as big as my house. Okay. Isn't it too much for you? If you eat it all, you're going to explode. <laughs> If it's that big. Okay. Uh, Yoshini. I'll unmute you. Tell us. Don't, don't, don't click on anything. I'll do it for you. I did it. Yoshini, tell us. Don't speak single. I'll speak English. Pizza. Yoshini. I want a strawberry. A strawberry. Yes. Okay, got it. Satini. Yes. What would you like to eat? I like to eat burger. A burger. How big? As big as an elephant? Yes. Elephant burger. Okay. <laughs> An elephant burger. Binuri. I want to big apple. Apple. How big? Big as my garden. As big as your garden. Okay. Joanna. Michelle. Yeah. 
Joanna? Pizza and strawberry. A pizza and strawberry. Half pizza. Big as to my house. As big as your house. Is it a pizza? Is it a strawberry pizza? Pizza with strawberries on top? Or pizza made of strawberries completely? Strawberry crust, strawberry filling, strawberry icing, strawberry everything, maybe. Okay. Anybody's hand is up? Raise your hand if you would like to tell me. There's a button. Click on the button to raise your hand. Then, then I can ask you. Then I know that you want to tell me the answer. Mahima again? Okay, Mahima. I want a giant hamburger. A giant hamburger. Okay, got it. Um, who else? Who didn't tell us anything yet? Uh, Natanya. Natanya? Toffee. A toffee, great. Bituni. A pizza. A pizza, okay. Limansa. I want a big, big mango. A big mango. I like mangoes too. Let's share. Half for you and half for me. Sanidi. Just talk, talk. Yeah. Yeah. I want a big pear. Big what? Hair? Big pear. Pear, not hair. <laughs> a big pear. Got it. Not a, yeah. not pear, but pear. Delicious. Metum. <laughs> yeah. I want the mango biggest my house. All right. There you are. Take it. And the last one, let Nuda. Biggest. Let Nuda. Biggest pen. Mm, of course. Okay. Saviru. Your hand is up. Um, uh... mm, chocolate. One more time, please. What is it? Um, oh, orange, orange. Oh, orange, a big orange. How big? Um, how big is? Uh, how big? How big? As big as the planet Earth. As Joy. big as the sun, as big as the moon. Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> All right, our time is over now. You look very tired. You can go and play now. I'll see you next week. Goodbye, everyone. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Goodbye. Goodbye. There's your baby brother. Right, so is that baby brother? Bye, bye. The answer to you, the sister. <laughs> He's crying. He's crying. <laughs> Michelle, too. That's your baby sister. And Beyonce's sister, too. Hello. Why are you holding her in your arms? She wants to run away. <laughs> Very cute. You look very cute. Yes, you look very, very cute. Don't fall. Bye. Go and play now. Bye. Go rest and play. See you next week. Bye bye. I'm ending now. Bye. 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 Bye.